It's time now for your top five plays of the week, brought to you by Play On Sports. Number five from the state of Florida, Sakai Singletary and Tristan Lewis of Northside Christian combine on a little trickery with the Mustangs facing fourth and 14. Lewis takes a handoff on the end around before stopping and throwing back to his quarterback Singletary, who uses a spin move and a dive to find the end zone on a 30 yard score. Northside Christian would lose the game 23 to 12. What a play. Singletary with a 30 yard touchdown catch. Number four from the state of Arizona, junior Mark Andrews of Desert Mountain pulls down the tip pass on the final play of the first half. For a 48-yard touchdown, Wolves would ride the momentum of Andrews TD and win their opening round playoff game 49-21 over Mesa Mountain View. 48-yard touchdown pass, final play of the second quarter. Number three from the state of South Carolina, Senior Noah Schuler does his best Barry Sanders impersonation as he somehow stays on his feet and stuns everyone in the stadium. Schuler's effort not enough though as the Knights comeback attempt fell short and they lose 31-23 to Goose Creek. Number two from the state of Arizona, watch this play as sophomore Dalton Sneed of Horizon bobbles the staff then spins twice like he hit the circle button on PlayStation and then launches a 51-yard touchdown pass to Jason McLaurin. Horizon would see their season come to an end, though, in a 24-20 loss to Apollo. And how about that? A touchdown. Dalton Sneed to Jason McLaurin. McLaurin's second touchdown catch of the game. And finally at number one from Illinois, senior Joey Radigan of Nequa Valley caps off his great night with this 53-yard touchdown run as he breaks tackle after tackle to put the game away for the Wildcats. Still on his feet, and he is going to be in the end zone for a touchdown. You've got to be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. Joey Radigan, you are ridiculous. Neckwood Valley would go on to win 44-33 over Bolingbrook and advance to the third round of the playoffs. That's your top five plays of the week from Play on Sports. High school sports lives here.